everybody, welcome to We've Got Questions. Uh, it's been a hard week. Yeah. It's been a really hard week uh, with everything in Charlottesville. So we found a really amazing story here that like makes me feel warm inside about two yeah. people who found love in this brutal world. Uh, but we wanted to express to everyone who counter-protested in Charlottesville this past weekend, uh, we stand with you, we stand against hate, and Thank you. there cannot be silence when ugliness like that presents itself. Thank you to everyone who was in Charlottesville, and thank you to everyone who has spoken out since then against it. We hope that this nice story about love can bring something nice to your day in such a terrible week. Yeah, so let's jump into it, right? Yeah. So, New York Times headline, she's 98, He's 94. I love this. They met at the gym. Ah. Oh, Gertrude. Of course her name's yeah. Gertrude. Gertrude Mokotov and Alvin Mann oh, found each other oh. and they decided to get married in, in New York this weekend. I haven't been in a gym in years. Yeah. I want to say years. Also, for a gym, like, you have to imagine that, like, she was, like, jazzercising. Like, yeah. you know, she was, like, water aerobics and yeah. he was, like, punching a big leathery like, oh, you bag, think so? you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> what is it about being 90 years old also that makes it like okay to hit on somebody at the gym? <laughs> 27 year old guy comes up to you at the gym and yeah. this hypothetical Sarah's at the gym. We're all, yeah. We all go to the gym in okay, this hypothetical Okay, I know it's gonna world. take a little imagination yeah. <laughs> here, but I want you to picture me, I know it's weird, at a gymnasium. Which is not to say, like, you're in great shape. I, want you to, I don't want you to think that this is I'm in right. not great shape. You're in great shape, you look great. Uh, I look great, but on the inside it's all, it's all rotten all right, away. So check, so check this out. <laughs> Like, Jordan. hey, I saw you from across the room. Uh, you want to go out sometime? 27. 27? What you, yeah, what do you think? Honestly, I'd say yes. <laughs> I'm ruining your bit. You're ruining I'm so the bit. sorry. You would say yes? I like right, getting guys. hit on. You like <laughs> <laughs> well, what does he look like? Does he look like you? Or is he more of a 98-year-old <laughs> guy? In the... the point of the bit was like, oh, there's no, nothing No, but I want to know 90... more about this guy. Like, what's his sign? <laughs> this like, guy's not real. What's his Status. This guy is like, what does not he do real. for a living? Do you want to know uh, Gertie's comments after the first date? Yes. Uh, after the first date, Gertie's comments were he was a perfect gentleman, mm -hmm. and there was something about him that made me want to talk more. <laughs> mm. You know what? I think they did it after the first date. <laughs> you think they had sex? I think they. I think they totally had sex. I don't I think, think you have sex with your ninety. I, don't I think, think they did. Think. What you think? What, what do you mean you don't think you have sex when you're 90? Just What's like it called? Physically, I don't know if you can have sex. I think there's so much medicine out there. I think they had better sex than I've ever had in my life. <laughs> oh, I just feel like I'm so tired now. I can only imagine when I'm 90 to be like, oh my God, no, I'm so tired. I bet you it was tantric. <laughs> I just want to gum something down and I want to go to bed. <laughs> Best part of the story, Gertie asked Alvin to marry her. Ah! Oh! You know what? I love it. She said, I was tired. I was tired of chasing him. Just let's do it, you know? Let's just get married. I'm 98. My clock's ticking here, you know? I love this yeah. so much. This wedding had to have happened at like 2 p.m. dinner at 3.30, oh, sure. right? <laughs> dinner served at 3.30. No dessert. We're mm -hmm. full. The music's too loud. Mm -hmm. Can we get some softer flowers for you to toss in the bouquet? <laughs> I've got brittle bones. Can you toss this for me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> were I, their vows to each other, you think? Mm -hmm. I think their vows were, um, Gert Gertrude, I promise to love you till the day I die. Oh, thanks, Alvin. Or 90 days, whichever one comes first. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think the playlist is for this? For, for this wedding? wedding, yeah. Uh, I think it goes Sinatra. I think uh, The Entertainer, that old ragtime song plays. <laughs> and I think it's a wedding, and I think you still play, like, Get Low. Like, I think, I think Get Low still works at this At wedding. the end of the night? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you think open bar? I think closed bar. Mm -hmm. I don't think open bar. Okay. But I think they went up and just demanded free drinks. I think everything came in IV bags. <laughs> <laughs> I think you were allowed to just take any IV bag you wanted to, and you could just, they had nurses there for everybody. Oh, that actually sounds great. Yeah. Doesn't mess up your lipstick. Doesn't mess up your lipstick at all. That brings us to today's big question. What do you think Gertie and Alvin's wedding hashtag was? Comment below. What do you think their hashtag was? I think it was hashtag Gert so good. <laughs> <laughs> I love that one. I really got it. I think it's for sure hashtag Gert so good. <laughs> I think Alvin and Gertie are huge John Mellencamp fans. 
Uh, that's insane. <laughs> so comment below uh, with what you think the wedding hashtag is. And speaking of wedding guys, uh, our own Sarah Parsons here has a wonderful sketch that just came out on Above Average this week. The sketch is called... Why I Said No to Being a Bridesmaid. It is so incredibly funny. Thank you. Uh, make sure you check it out. Sarah's great in it. There's a very handsome groomsman in it as well. There's also a wonderful website that Matt made, which is a fake engagement website for the couple that's in the video. If you've <laughs> ever been to a wedding, if you've ever known somebody who who's had a wedding. If you know what weddings are, we promise you, you're gonna like something You'll that you see here. Video. Thank you so much for watching. We've got questions. Uh, we love all of you. Uh, and yeah, we hope you're getting through this week okay. <laughs>